as we are just 24 hours removed from WWE No Way Out. We are less than four weeks away from our second WrestleMania here in Universe Mode. I am Boy One Two Three Jim. Welcome everyone to Monday Night Raw Live in Des Moines, Iowa. Leave a like on this video and subscribe now for more. Follow me on Twitter at Boy One Two Three Jim. And oh, here comes the. Gen I guess we're gonna start off with the general manager of Monday Night Raw, Mr. Shane McMahon, who brought back. Who's uh, going to bring back the Cruiserweight Championship by having a tournament which started last night at No Way Out with AJ Styles and Chris Jericho being in the tournament, the first round, the first match. I guess he has more to announce, especially WrestleMania coming up within less than four weeks in Orlando, Florida. Oh my god, what an event No Way Out was last night. What up, Des Moines, Iowa? Now tonight... As your general manager of Monday Night Raw, I'm here to announce a couple of things. First of all, uh, Vince McMahon on SmackDown came on here and basically announced what I should have announced last week, which I apologize for. That there will be a Fatal 4-Way Unification Women's Title Match that me and Mick Foley, the general manager of SmackDown, has been discussing for the past couple of weeks that this should finally come to an end, that there should only be one Women's Championship. And we're finally going to let it happen. At Wrestlemania. There will be a Fatal 4-Way. Women's title match. Now the thing is. That Mick Foley has to find that other participant. To be in that Fatal 4-Way match. At Wrestlemania. But since we already have. From under that Raw side. The uh, a participant. A challenger that's not a champion in that match, aka Alicia Fox. She won that battle royale last night at No Way Out. So tonight, Charlotte will take on Alicia Fox. All right, that's good. That's what's gonna happen tonight, live on Monday Night Raw. Also, now the thing about the world title picture. Now Neville, congratulations on winning the World Heavyweight Championship last night in the Elimination Chamber match. I didn't think you would do it. But you were able to pr prove the haters, prove the people wrong. Now, the thing is, John Cena retained the WWE title for Monday Night Raw side. Now, Randy Orton came to me earlier today saying he can't decide on who he will, uh, quote, face at WrestleMania. So, what he decided to do was what he suggested to me. And I was able to talk to McFoley and we we're going to make this happen tonight live on Raw. Neville, the world champion, is here tonight. He will face the WWE champion John Cena in the main event of Raw. And the winner of that match, in Randy Orton's words, will earn the right to challenge him for their respective world title in the main event of WrestleMania in Orlando, Florida. Now, I like the idea. Luckily, Mick Foley liked the idea, so we're going to have this happen tonight. So... That's it for the world title picture. So the winner of that match will officially challenge or face Randy Orton at, at WrestleMania for the respective world title. Also, the situation about the Intercontinental title. Now, the thing is, Seth Rollins and Ryback, I know one of them is going to come after me about that. So what, what we're going to do is tonight, Seth Rollins will challenge, uh, sorry, face Ryback, where the winner will face Kurt Angle for the Intercontinental Championship at WrestleMania in a one-on-one -on -one traditional match. That's it. That's all I have to announce to you guys. So I want to start Monday Night Raw live here in Des Moines, Iowa. I want to start it off with a bang. So what we're going to do is we're going to begin the show with a Cruiserweight tournament match. Our second match of the tournament. And guess what? It's not going to happen next week. It's going to start right now. And oh. And here we go. What a way to begin Monday Night Raw with, as Shane McMahon says, with a bang. The uh, Cruiserweight Tournament match. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Tokyo, Japan. Strongman. The king of strong style. Shinsuke Nakamura is in this tournament. Now, the thing was, Shinsuke Nakamura actually re retired the Cruiserweight title a couple of months ago, but... Lucky Shane McMahon brought it back. So tonight, live on Raw, we have Neville versus John Cena in our main event 
winner challenges Randy Orton at WrestleMania. And also Seth Rollins versus Ryback. Winner faces Kurt Angle for the, for the IC title. So Kingston versus Nakamura will begin the show in the first round of the tournament as Monday Night Raw rolls on. As we're back live on Monday Night Raw with Kingston dropping Nakamura with the neckbreaker. Goes for a cover for him in the face. But, oh, Kingston. Uh, I, think that, I think that was a bad mistake there. Playing around with the King of Strong Style. You don't want to do that, with, especially with Nakamura. Former IWGP champion and IWGP Intercontinental champion. Iris Whippet kicks in off the ropes. Going for a high knee. But Kingston. Oh, oh, forward Russian leg sweep. Goes Nakamura face spurs onto the mat. And now, oh, big shot by Nakamura. As uh, Nakamura now has Kingston. Oh, Dragon Whip. And now Nakamura just, just, I think Nakamura is in the zone. I think Nakamura is in his, in his own zone. Kingston looking to take him out, take, looking to take him out of his own zone. Swinging neckbreaker there by Kingston. Drag him to the middle of the ring. Kingston now off the ropes. Double leg drop across the abdomen of Nakamura. Hooks the outside leg, the boom drop, but it ended on kick out. Does Nakamura. Kicks to hit the boom drop. One of his signature maneuvers was not able to take down Nakamura. As uh, Kingston tried to go for a shot high knee by Nakamura. Go for a trumpet in paradise, but Nakamura blocked it. And now Nakamura now. Fisherman driver. Fisherman driver hooks the leg. Got Kofi Bridge kick out does Kingston. Oh, man. Nakamura and Kingston in the early going of this matchup. Nice suplex. It was like a half Nelson Explorer suplex. And all oh, here it comes. The King of Strong Style running knee strike. From, uh, known as the Kinshatsa. Knee to the face of Kingston by Nakamura. Hooks the outside leg. And Nakamura advances in the Cruiserweight Tournament. Oh my god. Nakamura advances in the Cruiserweight Tournament. Don't forget the finals will happen at WrestleMania. But Nakamura walks away with the win, with the win tonight. But let's jump coming up next. Seth Rollins will take on the big guy Ryback with the winner. Will challenge Kurt Angle, the new Intercontinental Champion at WrestleMania. Meaning in a one-on-one -on -one traditional style matchup. Who will win? Can the standard bearer of WWE win? Or will the big guy reign supreme? We'll find that out right now. You thought I was going to say next, huh? No, right now. He was making his entrance as I was speaking. So Seth Rollins coming out here tonight. And here comes Seth Rollins, the former Intercontinental Champion, lost his belt in a six-man battle royale at the Royal Rumble with this title, with his former championship on the line, the Intercontinental title. Lost it to Ryback. Ryback then went on to defend the belt at uh, No Way Out. Scheduled to face Seth Rollins in their one-on-one -on -one match, but Kurt Angle got involved, and now... Kurt Angle is the Intercontinental Champion. Look at that. So, we can't really tell who would win if it was a one-on-one -on -one match. So, we're going to find out tonight. Here comes the big guy. Former Intercontinental Champion Ryback. And approaching the ring from Las Vegas, weighing in at 291 pounds, Ryback. The big guy from Sin City. Former Intercontinental Champion lost his belt last night at No Way Out to Kurt Angle. Looking to take on Mr. Money in the Bank, Seth Rollins. I mean, when is Seth Rollins going to cash in that Money in the Bank briefcase? I mean, he held it ever since winning it back in the summer of last year. So, I don't, I don't know. 
But here comes the big guy right back. Here's a fact for you guys. Kurt Angle at one point was the Intercontinental Champion in his early days in the WWE. But lost the belt in a triple threat. And luckily enough, ironically, won the belt in a triple threat last night. But he will defend it at WrestleMania in a one-on-one -on -one traditional match. So, as Monday Night Raw rolls on, who will challenge Kurt Angle at WrestleMania? We'll find out when we come back. As we're back live on Monday Night Raw. Kick to the bed section by Seth Rollins. And now Rollins take it right back onto the outside. As uh, Seth Rollins and right back. Having this match, winner faces Kurt Angle at WrestleMania. Look at Seth. Seth! Seth diving onto the outside. Right onto Ryback. Look at that. Oh my god. Ryback. The, imp the impact from the, the maneuver from Seth Rollins. Launching Ryback onto the barricade. Imagine if that was like the old steel barricade. Oh my god. That would have been nasty. Now look at Ryback. Bringing Seth Rollins back inside the ring. Elbow to the head of Rollins. And now the big guy. Just feeding off the momentum of the fans. Here in Seth Rollins' hometown, mind you. Here tonight. As oh, big guy. Clothesline on Seth Rollins. Ducks it. Back body drop coming. Yes. Back body drop by Seth. I mean by Ryback to Seth Rollins. Spine buster by the big guy. The big guy with a spine buster. Normally when went for a Miho close on the corner, but he made a close line anyway to Seth Rollins. Miho close line taking out Mr. Money to Bank. Is that it? Will Ryback challenge Kurt Angle and WrestleMania? No, and a kick out. Barely. Barely kicked out. The Seth Rollins. Barely able to kick out, but uh Ryback now. Oh man. Driving Seth Rollins' head onto the mat. But Rollins got up to his feet. And now Ryback has Seth, front headlock, doing damage to the head and neck area. Oh, Insiguri head kick by uh, Seth Rollins. Rollins looking to create separation, and he did at that moment. Now, now uh, Rollins, kick to the midsection, running form to the face of the champion. Goes for the uh, former champion, I should say. Cover hooks the outside leg, two count kick out. Thus Ryback, man. I'm still thinking that Ryback's the Intercontinental Champion. Man. Gotta remember, Kurt Angle's the new champ now. As uh, Seth Rollins. Ryback. Going at it. Oh my god! The running knee! The running jumping knee that actually messed up Cena's nose years ago. And now, and now oh, Rollins! Rollins got caught! Ryback got up to his feet! Rollins in trouble! Marching! Ryback got him! What the show shock! Show shock by the big guy. The fans are chanting, This is awesome. Show shock by Ryback. Hooks the outside leg. He got him all. The kick out to Seth Rollins. Got the shoulder up. Mr. Money in the Bank still fighting here tonight, live on Raw in his hometown. Looking to go to WrestleMania and challenge Kurt Angle for the IC title. Go for a double X handle does Ryback. Shot to the face by Rollins. Off the ropes. Ducks it. Rollins now. Flip out the DDT. Float over the DDT by Seth Rollins. Oh my god. What a matchup. And now Rollins. Suplex. Suplex. No. Knee to the head. And now. And the fans of Chang feed me more. As uh, towards Ryback. Oh my. Backpack stunner. Backpack stunner. And now Ryback. Looking to end it. Ryback in the corner. Miho clothesline. Miho clothesline. Desperately goes for the cover. Hooks the outside leg. Ryback challenges Kurt Angle for the Intercontinental title. Ryback versus Kurt Angle. One on one. For the Intercontinental Championship. The big guy goes to WrestleMania as a challenger for the first time in Universe Mode. Ryback challenges for the Intercontinental title at WrestleMania. I hope Kurt Angle was watching. That was a fantastic matchup. But ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, Alicia Fox takes on the WWE Women's Champion. 
live on Monday Night Raw two women that's in that fatal four way match at WrestleMania, and it's next. It's your back live on Monday Night Raw with Alicia Fox in the ring during her entrance. Lisa Fox able to win a battle royale last night. Able to qualify herself. Normally she would have been number one contender, but Shane McMahon and Mick Foley have been talking about unifi unifying the women's and divas title. So she has qualified herself to be in that fatal forward match along with the WWE Women's Champion and the WWE Divas Champion. And there comes the Women's Champion. Here comes Charlotte, the WWE Women's Champion, who defeated Paige back at the, at Tribute to the Truth, I should say, Def and then defended and retained the belt at the Royal Rumble. And ever since then, Charlotte, I mean, there's no one else that could ch challenge Charlotte for the women's title. So, I guess that's why we're having the unification match. So there'll be more women to compete once you're the champion. So you don't have to do so you don't have to defend your belt against the same person over and over again. But there we go. Charlotte versus Alicia Fox. And the bell is rung, and here we go. Color uh oh, I, oh now we got a colorable time. I was gonna say colorable time earlier, but Charlotte got him to an arm wrench. Right, wrenching the arm of Alicia Fox now. Twisting and turning it, and now just applying more pressure. And oh, nice takedown by Charlotte. And Alicia Fox, oh, suffers a DDT by the champion. Stopped by Charlotte. I mean, oh, Alicia Fox firing back with a shot to the gut. Ira whipping the champion off the ropes. Single leg drop kick. Goes for a cover for him in the face. Two, one, oh, a one count. I thought that was going to be a two count, but I was wrong there. But, um... Lisa Fox, don't get it wrong, former women's champion. Remember, she won a, I believe, a triple threat match a couple months ago. And out of champions, nice back suplex by uh, by Lisa Fox onto the champion. Lisa Fox, former women's champion, won the belt back at Night of Champions, but lost the belt to Paige one month later at Unforgiven. DDT there by Charlotte. Big kick to the spine by Charlotte. Backhand chop. And now Charlotte taking down Alicia Fox onto the second rope. Shot to the to the back there. And now Charlotte running knee. Running knee to the face of one of the competitors in the Fatal Forward match. Alicia Fox. Man. And now, oh, look, look at this. Look at this. Alicia Fox able to get out of that cross leg lock attempt from Charlotte for him in the face now. Irish whip from one corner to the other. Alicia Fox running high knee to the midsection of the champion. But now Charlotte fighting back in the early goal and kick to the midsection. And now, Charlotte high knee by uh, Alicia Fox. Alicia Fox high knee again. Just taking it to the champion and now tossing her across the ring just by the grab of her hair. And I, oh, a knee drop to the face of the champion. Lisa Fox now rolling here tonight. Look at it being in control. Oh no. Elbow to the face by Charlotte. No, 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 no. Tilt to World Sidewalk Slam by Alicia Fox. And now Alicia Fox now. Oh! Nice maneuver there. It's like a, a unique version of a leg drop. Cover hooks the outside leg on the champion. Two count. Kick out the Charlotte. I was going to say, Lisa Fox pinned the women's champion. Look at the game momentum. Oh, what a spear. Oh, my God. Out of nowhere, what a spear by Charlotte. The same move that beat Paige at the rumble. Hooks the leg. Kick out the Lisa Fox. Now the momentum in the match is starting to pick up between both women here tonight. Shot to the face, and now Charlotte and Alicia trading blows back and forth. But now Charlotte has Alicia Fox now onto the ropes. Oh my God! Backhand chop. 
Alicia Fox over the top onto the outside. Jeez. And now, oh, just, just whipping her onto the, just onto the apron. Referee had a count of three now. And now Charlotte looking to take it up to the ramp. If you haven't done it yet, check out WWE.com. Referee had a count of four. That's both women. Oh, DDT by Charlotte. On to Alicia Fox. Charlotte now looking to get back inside the ring. Count of six. Alicia Fox just just now getting up to her feet. Recovering. Still, I don't know how she recovered from that DDT under the ramp. Charlotte taunting, but does she realize now she realizes it? That Alicia Fox is back inside the ring. And now Alicia Fox now. Oh man. Form to the spine. And again. Tremendous match here on Raw. Back and forth they go. Between both women. I want to know what that Fatal 4-Way match is going to be like at WrestleMania. I mean, last year we had Nikki Bella versus Brie Bella. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Kick to the gut. You know what's coming up next? Natural selection. Natural selection by the champion. Hooks the outside leg. Charlotte got Charlotte got it. Charlotte gets it. Charlotte Flair, the women's champion, gets the win tonight. Here live on Monday Night Raw, just decreasing Alicia Fox momentum. Here's your winner, Charlotte. Wow. What a matchup. Alicia will be coming up next. It is our main event. Neville takes on John Cena. Where the winner will challenge, so to speak, <laughs> against Randy Orton for the respective world titles at WrestleMania. Would it be Neville or would it be John Cena? We'll find that out. It's our main event, and it's next. Let's go back live on Monday Night Raw as we're heading towards our main event with the new World Heavyweight Champion from SmackDown, Neville. Here comes Neville, the World Heavyweight Champion, who won the Elimination Chamber match last night. At No Way Out, defeating Brock Lesnar in his hometown, The Rock, Baron Corbin, Batista, and Christian, all to become world champion. I guess Neville has not uh, updated the, the title yet. I mean, still got Brock Lesnar's uh, thing on the side plates, but maybe he might change the whole thing this uh, Wednesday night on SmackDown. Um, I don't know. And here comes the man that defeated and overcame five other superstars in the Elimination Chamber match for the WWE title, John Cena. I don't know how the hell he did it. I have no idea. I actually had a lot of doubt, but that's what John Cena is all about. When people give him, when people give him a lot of doubt, he proves them wrong. He proved me wrong last night. Let's see if he can do it again tonight. Live on Monday Night Raw. Can John Cena, so to speak, earn the chance to fight Randy Orton? John Cena and Randy Orton has a, historic, uh, a historical rivalry, no doubt. I mean, who could ever forget? You know, No Way, uh, no way Out 2008. You know, SummerSlam 2009. SummerSlam 2007. All those years. That Iron Man match. The I Quit match. The Hell in the Cell all those matches you can think of between Orton and Cena. But they never fought at WrestleMania. It could all happen at WrestleMania between Orton and Cena. All Cena has to do is just beat Neville. I'm pretty sure the general manager of SmackDown, Mick Foley, is watching tonight's show because his world champion is on the show and hoping that it will be Neville challenged, uh, facing Randy Orton. At WrestleMania, but here we go. John Cena, Neville, main event. Here we go. Both men kicks to the gut to begin the match. And now got up a tie up side headlock by Neville. And now Neville taking down the WWE Champion. Yeah. Nice shot to the face by Neville onto John Cena. This is the first champion versus champion since my birthday edition of Monday Night Raw back on July 1st. So, yeah, a couple weeks back. I believe you're heading into the Royal Rumble. And now Neville 
Lord of Light suplex onto John Cena. Oh man, and now Cena kicking back up. This could be a fantastic main event, or it could be a disappointing one. We'll find out which one will it be. Cena stomped to the face and then followed up with an elbow drop to the chest of Neville. Shot to the spine by Cena. Onto Neville and knocking down Neville again. And again, Cena with the shots all over Neville. And now Cena has Neville. Iris whip off the ropes. And look at. Oh! Neville with a power bomb. I mean, I mean, Cena, I think he was going to go for a Hurricane but Neville countered. With a Hurricane caught Cena in midair. Now Neville, childbreaker to the champ. And now Cena has the world champion. Oh, Fireman's carry. And now Cena now has Neville down. Going for a cross leg lock. But look at Neville, turning it around. Able to get out of it. And now Neville, going for a suplex. No, it countered. Cena counters ne with a suplex of his own. And now Cena, elbow. Elbow to the temple of Neville. And now Cena now turns Neville around. Go for a shot to the back. But Neville got out to the outside. Now Cena goes on to the outside. But Neville back inside the ring already. And now, oh, kick to the bed section. Cena now. Fisherman suplex. Fisherman suplex by the WWE champion. And oh, here it comes. Here it comes. John Cena, you can't see me. John Cena off the ropes. Cena now. Five knuckle shuffle on the world heavyweight champion. John Cena. Oh my god, this could be it. No way. John Cena. Oh my god. John Cena got him up. Attitude adjuster. AA by Cena. Onto the world champion. No way. John Cena faces Randy Orton at WrestleMania. Oh my god, that's it. Wow. Very disappointing for Neville, I have to say, but. For Monday Night Raw's sake, oh well, John Cena gets the win here live on Raw. John Cena, the WWE Champion, will face Randy Orton at WrestleMania. I hope Randy Orton was watching. John Cena will face Randy Orton in the main event of WrestleMania. Our second annual WrestleMania here in Universe Mode in Orlando, Florida. It's going to be a good one. I can't wait. So hope you guys enjoyed tonight's episode of Monday Night Raw, the fallout of No Way Out. Leave a like on this video, subscribe now for more. Follow me on Twitter, at boy 13 gem Make sure you stay tuned for this Wednesday night, Smackdown. I'm out. Good night from Des Moines, Iowa.